In 1988, Geraldine Couts gets a phone call telling her to go to the roundhouse on her reservation. There she is raped and beaten. With her is a young woman named Mela and Mela's little girl. The story of their ordeal is slowly revealed in this compelling novel. Geraldine's husband is the head judge of the Ojibwe Nation in North Dakota. He and Geraldine have a son named Joe, who is slowly placed in the role of parental child as his mother retreats more and more into herself and does not leave her bedroom. She is suffering from depression and trauma that separates herself from the rest of the world. Who is responsible for this crime in the criminal justice system, the white criminal system, or the Indian system? This comes into question time and time again. Joe relies more and more on his closest friends, Cabby, Zack, and Angus, for support. His father is emotionally distant and his mother is gone from him completely as she stays in her darkened room in silence. This is one of Erdrich's stronger books. It is heavy and intense with no lightness of spirit at all. I highly recommend it.